Mr. You who thinks you're sent, sent from above, as innocent as a dove, and without fault like some of us. Though I saw the red flags, I loved you regardless. And when you look straight into my eyes and wrap me into your loving hands, at that moment, I saw a future with you like a flashback of memories that felt so true. And in that moment, my heart decided to love you, but my mind accepted the fact that you loving me back would just be a dream that would never come true. Mr. You, you left me when I needed you the most. Even when I showed you love in my right hand and showing you the truth in my left hand. Mr. You, you are not ashamed to get in between my legs and now you're ashamed of me to meet your people and you made it so simple you say that i am not a wife material when you made me a mom and not a wife you didn't think about me having those qualities of a so-called wife material wow i'm a bad guy right mr you or should i say mr right breaking my heart into pieces and stones drop into this broken heart and each stone builds a wall of isolation I drown in this wall of bottomless desolation and each lie that comes from your lips drives devotion away I cry each day I die a little along the way with no one to wipe my tears away Mr. You with no shame in your eyes you're so quick to notice my flaws but you couldn't notice the pain the suffering and the rejection that you made me go through Mr. You taking away my self-esteem my confidence and my dreams Mr. You where were you when I couldn't sleep at night not even a call or a text to check on me or my unborn child I did the calling and the texting you only called me when you needed sex well guess what I've learned that pain can only control you if you hold it within And so I have laid down the pain at the altar of Christ Just so I can tell you this I forgive you I forgive you so that I can finally be free I forgive you for the sake of my son So that I can show him that Love, peace and forgiveness is a way of life